All right, guys, go to Boy 32 here. Check it out, man. I'm sitting out here at the range, and we're shooting the Mark AR. I decided to do this from a sitting position today. Add a little bit of a unique specialty to it. I'm going to try not to shoot from the bench anymore. I don't particularly care for it. What we'll do is I'm just going to shoot just like this. So we can go ahead and position this angle a little bit. And that way, you guys can see what's going on here. So here we go. And again, I'm shooting with a target down there at the 50. And uh, pretty crowded today, so uh, that's basically what we're looking at. So, Spark AR. Why did I do a Spark AR? Well, here's the deal. Um, Could have gone with Bushnell TRS-25. It's a great little red dot. Could have gone with an MRO. Awesome red dot. Trishicon. Can't go wrong. But this little guy right here, the reason I went with this, well, let's talk about this. The $199 deal from Palmetto State Armory with the 10 mags, that was a heck of a deal. It was actually on special this week uh, with the uh, discount code for $130. Bucks. That wasn't bad. All right, so you got a 2 MOA dot in here, a bunch of lifetime. Uses uh, AAA batteries in the front. Really cool. Ten settings, I believe it is. This is always fun. You get these guys over here. But I wanted something that was reliable, usable. Uh, wasn't cheap. Wasn't expensive. And I had almost have to say that this is probably one of the best red dots on the market in its dollar value, dollar range. One ninety nine off Amazon. You can get them all day long at some places for 130 bucks, and it's just a steal. I'm going to tell you what, man. I love this thing. Low light levels coming down. And I tell you, you can go ahead and turn that thing, the dot, down low, and you can really pinpoint it. It's really, really nice. Now, one of the things that I do like about it is the rubber coating in front of it. However, if you look at mine, I tore the little caps off. I'm not a big fan of those. Uh, I'll probably put some kind of a bikini cap cover on it, but really, truly, I never keep them on there. Field of view on this thing is adequate. Uh, I don't have any problems with it, but the nice thing is I can usually shoot with both eyes open unless I'm trying to pinpoint a target. If it's something really close, CQB wise, leave both eyes open. Search and scan with one eye pinpointing with the right eye. Take some practice, but you can do it. Good stuff. All right, another reason I went with the Vortex is because of the warranty. Guys, this thing's got a no questions asked replacement. One of the best in the market. This thing is awesome with the integrated rails, the different risers you have on it. You can integrate it and you can go with a perfect co-witness. Let's go on down there and uh, see how we did. <laughs> it should be interesting. I love shooting from the sitting position. All right, so I'm sitting out here with my buddy, Money Bags. What up? He brought one of his cheap rifles out today. So I did. <laughs> oh my gosh. So anyway, check this out. So uh, sitting in the position, 50 yards, not a bad little deal. Uh, kind of rushed and trying to do some videos at the same time. All right, here's the deal. So if you want something that's great quality, good warranty, excellent company, it's not going to break the bank, but it's also going to provide you with something that's going to last forever. This guy right here, the Vortex Spark AR. I'm not just trying to sell it. I'm convinced that's a great looking scope because let's just face it, it's got to look good, but it's also a performer. Two MOA dot, all those light settings, bright light, doesn't matter. Sitting in the sitting position, 50 yards, not really paying attention. I'm sure if I took my time, I could probably do a little better. Let's go to Boy 32, support the red, white, and blue. God bless America. God bless us men, women, in uniform 24 7 for our freedom because freedom is not free. Let's go to Boy 32. Out. Keeping your breath. Yes, evening. I'm keeping my breath. Keeping your breath.
keeping my breath. Oh, shit, I'm out.